All right, 1219 on this Wednesday afternoon. I hope you guys are enjoying the beautiful weather. We missed out on the rain last night. Much of the area missed out. Some saw a little bit of rainfall, but officially at the airport, just a trace of needed rain. So our deficit continues to grow for the month of May over an inch behind normal. And so far for the year, we're over five inches behind pace. Now, all the action today is either to the west or to the east of us. There is a slight risk for widespread severe weather for uh, much of the east coast. And then there is a more concerning moderate risk for widespread severe weather. That's level four or five here on the scale from North Platte, uh, Nebraska down towards Hayes, Kansas. This is obviously the bullseye of Tornado Alley, and it will probably live up to its name today. Likely some tornadoes out that way. Currently at TMJ4, we have a temperature of 73 degrees. Beautiful outside. Look at the blue skies in Waukesha, 72 degrees. A west wind at 14 miles per hour and the dew point at 48. That is really comfortable, especially considering we started in the 60s early this morning. 77 in Milwaukee and Racine. The dew points are now in the upper 40s. Man, that feels good. Here's your dew point cast and it will remain comfortable humidity wise the next several days leading right into the weekend. But we got some cooler temperatures to go along with it starting later on this evening and into the weekend. All right, weather headlines. Enjoy today. The chill is on the way, and then we get a cold rain to arrive late Thursday, and it could last through much of Friday. Storm Formax radar and satellite showing uh, some scattered clouds trying to develop uh, up towards uh, Fond du Lac. As we widen the view out more, you can see more cloud cover in northern Wisconsin. And already got a severe thunderstorm uh, developing in that area that's targeted with uh, that uh, moderate risk by the Storm Prediction Center. High pressure though to the west will keep our weather quiet and sunny for today. Again, we're looking good now by tonight. The clouds will start to thicken up after midnight. By the way, uh, tonight's a full moon. It's a super moon too, so get out early after sunset. See the full moon. Clouds will blanket the sky later on tonight. Now lots of clouds to start the day tomorrow, and I think we're dry up until about three o'clock, and then we'll have a chance of some showers moving in. Then rain becomes likely overnight. Look at this. This looks like almost a guaranteed rain for us that could linger through much of the day on Friday, finally wrapping up late Friday afternoon. Uh, rainfall amounts pretty impressive. I think much of the area could see a half inch to an inch of rainfall with maybe some locally higher amounts. Your forecast for today, mostly sunny and breezy, pretty much where we stand 77 for tonight. Low temperature of 50 degrees, breezy and cool inland 44. That cool air really starts to work in here lakeside with the northeast wind by about six, seven o'clock this evening, turning much cooler. OK, on Thursday, 52 for the high. That's it. Rain moves in late 50 on Friday. That's 20 degrees below normal. A rainy Friday, sunny on Saturday, 60, 64 Sunday, 70 on Memorial Day with a slight chance of showers and a slight chance of showers on Tuesday.